David Dillard from Sleep and Sinus Centers of Georgia, talking to you again about uh, actually some sinus stuff and sinusitis stuff and some offbeat um, irrigations that we've uh, seen in the past and sort of where those things might fit into the overall scheme of things. Um, one of the concepts in the last 10 years that is useful um, in this field is the concept of biofilms. Biofilms are basically uh, groups of bacteria that create a slime housing like an igloo that they sit in and these things stick to the walls of the sinuses and they provide sources for bacteria coming back over and over again. And, um, and the, the gist of this is, is that we want to try and um, eliminate as much as possible uh, biofilms in the sinuses. And one of the things that happens with that is they don't grow and they're not taking any nutrients, so they don't take in antibiotics either. So you almost have to either mechanically knock them off. One of the reasons we do irrigations is that it does help to keep those bacterial counts down, but you, you sometimes have to do something to get those housing, that slime coat that they live underneath uh, or are hibernating in underneath off the sinus wall. So um, that being said, um, one of the ways that people have come up with it, it I thought it was kind of interesting, is to use uh, Johnson's baby shampoo in the irrigation formula. Now the exact formula for that, if you need that, your doctor will give you, but there's some validity to that. And probably a reasonable degree of, of uh, science behind that, but it's worth a try. It's basically you know, standard saline, which is salt water, and you can make your own. Um, and that's a, a fairly um, easy thing to do, um, but, um, but that's another talk for another day. And so um, if you have someone who suggests this to you, it's a, a thing to check into, and it's, that's, that's the science behind why they may have suggested it to you. So if you get a suggestion to use Johnson's baby shampoo up the nose, that's what it's about. Thanks, hope it's helpful, and we'll talk to you soon.